Hello everybody and welcome to another elevator parts video. Today I'm going to show you how to wire up innovation elevator buttons. Let's go ahead and get started. So this here is a pretty small and pretty basic innovation call button. Here on the back we can see how it works. It's pretty simple. We have the innovation logo on the top. We've got the piece here which pushes on to the little micro switches. And then on the back we have our connectors. So if you wanted to take one of these buttons off, you would just unscrew these little nuts here and the whole circuit board and base would come off. So now what about wiring one of these? Now it's fairly simple. You'll notice down here on the bottom, you'll notice each of these pins has a different label. Here we have our common, our normally open, normally closed, and our light. Now what that means is common is for our switch and that's common to both the normally open and the normally closed. And then the normally open is, well, normally open. So the, there is no contact being made between these two when the button is not pressed in. But when you press it, it completes the circuit. And normally closed, well, it's normally closed. So when the button's not being pressed in, it's making connection. And when you press it, it breaks the connection. And then lamp, that is for our little LED. And in this case, it has the R stamped, so it's a red one. The other side has the exact same setup, and the same thing can be found on this button. So wiring it is pretty easy, and then you're only gonna need a few things. First, we'll be powering this with a nine volt battery, so you'll need a nine volt battery clip. And then we're gonna need to hook some things together, so you'll need some wires. Now you'll need one small wire per button, and then you'll need two wires so we can bring the positive and negative connectors over to the next button. So first thing you wanna do is choose a side and choose a button to work on, and we're going to locate our common connector. Take the positive end of your nine volt battery and place it in there. And if you're connecting another button, place your little wire in there and tighten it down. Then you'll want to take your small wire and place it into the normally open pin and tighten it down. And then push the other end of your little wire into the lamp connector. So it should look something a little like this. Then you wanna take the negative end of your battery connector and hook it to the lamp connector on the other side. And if you're connecting any other buttons, place another wire into here. So now you have one of the two buttons connected. And all we have to do now is bring our little negative connector to the corresponding negative pin on the next button. And the same thing with the positive, bring it over to the common on your next button and then use your small wire to connect the normally open and the lamp. If you had more buttons than this, you would basically do the same thing for each button. You would bring another wire off this one to the next button and so forth and continue the same pattern until you've wired all of your buttons. And that's pretty much all there is to it. If I go ahead and place a battery on here and press each of the buttons, you'll see they light up. All right, so that was a little tutorial on how to wire up these innovation elevator buttons. Hope you learned something from this video. Hope you found it useful, hope you enjoyed it. And as always, thank you guys for watching and we'll see you in the next one.